another fine morning here at 6.30 a.m. on Grigna Farm, featuring your favorite fella, Grigna himself. Would you look at that? Thanks to some incredible artwork from someone over in Discord. I'm so sorry, I've forgotten your name. I uh, We now have true to canon real life Grigna. Look at this man with the Joris on his head and the straps on his body and you know how it goes. So uh, first thing to talk about is I fixed all the problems. There were one or two issues like the, the NPCs pathing into each other. Oh, we need to get going. Time is ticking. Uh, NPCs pathing into each other and that type of weird stuff. We read these yesterday, didn't we? Robin wants more money, of course, because she's part of this extortion racket that we call Stardew Valley. There were some issues with the pathfinding and whatnot, which I fixed because of uh, the, the Nexus mod manager uh, called Vortex. It turns out if you use that for Stardew Valley, it can sometimes do a bit of a fucky-wucky. So I've unfucky wucky it, and I've reverted all the mods back to their regular version. That took a little while. Uh, and we're using Vortex, in, uh, not using Vortex, we're using just basic Smappy instead now. So that is uh, thoroughly in the bin. And we're back to business. So here we are, back with Grigna. Now, lots of people left comments on last episode telling me how to uh, fish good. Uh, and I don't think that's too much of an understatement to say that. There was so much fishing-based advice. In fact, I've written a lot of it down here. Let me just bring this over from my other, from my other screen. So, somebody said if we use the scythe, we can clear areas in the farm without using any energy. So, I might just dash through at some point between episodes and just chop everything down. Uh, somebody said because we're using the part of the community mod that basically means when we speak to people, they'll see us and they'll be like, Oh, that's uh, what, a, what a nice guy out there. Actually, I'll go back and get the hoe in case we see any worms. They'll think, oh, what a nice guy that man is with his big, strong muscles. Wow, we look at him. It's Grigna himself. He'll make a name for himself in the community. I actually quite like that feature. Um... But yeah, no, 90% of the comments on the, the last episode were about uh, fishing, which is something we are going to do today, and we're going to do it hard, because we need to get that backpack for Grigna ready for him to go into the mine and live his true Grigna destiny of killing and getting a lot of treasure. we got to go to the, yeah, saloon mid-afternoon so that we can go and basically speak to a load of people because there'll be a load of people there, at least according to the person in the comments. And if they've lied to me, oh, they have quite the man to deal with now, don't they? Quite the specimen indeed. <laughs> the farm animals are going to be shit scared. This giant bear with massive shaved arms coming towards them. So let's go fishing for it. We'll just go fishing, I suppose. Ah, oh, there we are. Ooh, gold ore. Thank you. Uh, we'll go fishing down here because somebody said the further you cast your line out away from land, I suppose down there would be the best place to do it. Firstly, the further you cast your line out away from land, so if you're fishing in the river, aim for the middle of the river. Otherwise, if you're in the ocean, aim for the furthest part out. So I guess if we do it here, try and go as far as possible. Okay, well, good enough, I suppose. Try and get it as far as possible, because that will increase the fish quality. They said try and keep it in the bar, the middle bar, as much as possible. If you do it perfectly, that will increase the quality. We've got to um, fish horizontally, not vertically, because you throw your law farther horizontally. Oh, there's a lot, of, well, a lot of complicated stuff happening, okay? But I've also got some UI info now. Really? I've also got the UI info suite, which means we can actually see, like, luck levels and things like that. Maybe you should stay home today. Does that mean that we're less likely to get, like, good fishes and stuff like that? Oh, I've already messed this up. I think, I, I think I've think i already messed that up. Unbelievable. 16 experience. We got, a, we got a nice little... What's this one down here? Oh, that's the experience bar for fishing. Oh, cool. We could probably get rid of this one up here, then. Right? I, I guess it is probably that. Kaboom. There you go. I don't know why this isn't working up here. Streak is still zero. You presume that catching a fish would increase your streak, but I guess not. Maybe we need a better fish rod, maybe we need bait, who, who knows. I, I think it is because we can't actually get treasure right now with this with this rod, if I remember correctly. I think you need the, the better one to do that. Oh! A soggy newspaper. How lovely. Grigna can't read anyway, so that's not a big deal. Ten strength, one intelligence. Just a nice peaceful day here fishing. <clears throat> this is already testing my patience a little bit. It was supposed to be low blood pressure experience, and I'm... I'm not feeling very relaxed right now. Fish! Sur oh! Surrender to Grigna. How the hell are you supposed to keep the fish in the middle of the bar? Like that. 
That is witchcraft. Only a witch could do something like that. Maybe it is better to cast from here, because that might count as land. There's no way that 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 is further away. Whatever. There you go. That's fishing. <laughs> My patience has been tried. Yeah, I think it might even be worth waiting then until we get the fishing rod that's capable of... Hello. Uh, get the fishing rod that's actually capable of getting... What's that? Oh, that's actually disgusting. Trout soup. Mmm. Yeah, take these off my hands. Thank you. Give it one more go. Let's give it one more go. Just for... I, I feel like fishing on an unlucky day is probably a terrible idea. We should be looking for... No, oh, come on. You can do it. God, oh, shit. Uh, we should be looking for bubbles as well, people were saying, so that we can fish slightly better. Those seagulls must be so fucking confused. Look at that bear over there with that fishing rod. <laughs> oh, I should go see if there's a quest. It's also midday. I'm supposed to be at the saloon. When you say midday, do you mean like midday as in the, the, the actual definition of midday? Like the middle of the day as in like 12, as in like noon? Or do you mean midday as in like the middle of the day, which in this is like 3 p.m.? Really does make you think. Let's go to the special beach, seeing as it took Grigner a long time to get that wood. Hey, there we go. Oh, it's the fella that sounds you the, what is it, the mermaid necklace? Or something like that? He says the mermaid necklace you can marry someone, or is it divorce someone? What's the difference? Man, I wish we had a running mod. Oh, he's also got the dinosaur pants, which I know you're supposed to buy from a shop, but it, it suits him. Reminds him of his old pal, Dinky. His old pal, Boone. Hello. Have you planted any spring crops yet? I have. Not very many. You're right. I probably should. I probably should plant some more. Oh! A free fish? Yeah, so all their move routes look as if they might be working now. Uh, Mayor Lewis and uh, Haley aren't smashing together on the bridge. For better or worse. Hello? There's no one in here. You've lied to me. Oh, but he sells all of our brewing stuff. Yes, this is what Grigner needs to make himself a... Grape, hops, honey? I, I guess you brew that into mead? Tea leaves, I presume. You brew that into tea. That would make a lot of sense. Did you mean evening rather than midday? Maybe you did mean midday. Maybe because it's raining. Wow, there are just so many mysteries here in Stardew Valley. Hello. Clint wants 15 copper ore. Clint, I got some bad news, big man. The mines are shut. I'm going to accept the quest. Hope that doesn't upset him when I <laughs> don't actually give him anything there. How do you get a better fishing rod? Maybe I'm losing my mind. Maybe you can't. We're going for a little, we're going for a little explore. See if there's any stuff to salvage. Then we'll do a bit more fishing, I suppose. Maybe I should go to Pierre and buy more seeds. I have no idea what I'm doing. You am panicking slightly, because, look. Robin gets violent when she doesn't get her money, okay? You don't know what she's like. One minute, it's, oh, I helped you. I've, I helped you restore your grandpa's house. Oh, by the way, it's 100,000 gold. Next minute, she's turning up at the front door with a bat. Brilliant. She's going to break Grigner's legs. Grigner's strength 10, Robin's strength 11. Linus. Hello. A warm rain is a pleasant way to get clean. Yes, it is, Linus. Yes, it is. Oh, it's really not. It's really not. You live by the ocean. Rain by the ocean stinks. Oh, free turnip. Wow. You need these for the community bundles, right? Spring foraging, there you go. Oh, that's pretty good. Thank you. Oh, seven experience. Wow. What a wasted day. What an actually wasted day. Can we fish down here? Oh, that's probably another thing that's worth mentioning. Some people are asking, oh, what? they were saying like, oh, your farm is probably broken because you picked the beach farm. And this is clearly not a beach farm. That's intentional. So the farm that I downloaded replaces the beach farm, but you still have to click on the beach farm to get the farm, if that makes sense. So it's all it's all above board. Don't worry. Let's zoom out a little bit so we can see a bit more of this. Oh, that's that's maximum. That's fine. I can work with that. That seems pretty good. Right, you can have this shit. I might start keeping some of these. Yeah, I think I'll start keeping them. The UI info suite is working really well now, actually. We can see how much it's worth. Oh, that's pretty good. Right, you can have that. Uh, this can go in, I guess, this box. Oh, God, this is a fucking mess. Who arranged these? Oh! Who arranged these? Field snack? I'm going to keep that in my pocket. Thank you. 
Oh shit. <laughs> We've got any I need to build more chests. I need to build a few more chests, I think. Let's explore the farm then. I want to see what we've got going on here. And we can always fish here, apparently, for sardines, eels, herrings, anchovies, and flounders. Uh, give me my scythe, I suppose. You know what? We'll take everything. We'll clear our way to the river. That way, if we want to just sit there and blast out the 2,000 silver, gold, G's, I could stand for anything. We can just get straight up tomorrow and, and get to work. Grigna grind set. That's what Grigna is short for. Grind set. Hang on, let me background in this. Gr Grigna is short for grind set, realizing, in, great, new, radicals. Grind set, realizing, in great, new, radicals. It's the Grigna method. And you... For only $24.99 a month, can get unique, exclusive access to Grigna's Discord channel, where people that he is underpaying will tell you the secrets of also following his way of life. You two can be as successful as Grigna, that's right. Oh, seaweed, you can eat that, right? Okay, that's actually not bad. I'm gonna go like there. Hey, there it is. Optimal. You see this? This is optimal Grigna. You better pay for that Discord. How much does that sell for? <laughs> We've got 2,000 gold to run and we're earning it 20 at a time. Brilliant. Fishes. Yes. Trash. It's junk. We're going to be here a long... Why is, is there not music to play? This is very creepy. Is there not supposed to be a soundtrack to this game? <laughs> Just Greg now hanging out. Enjoying the silence. Oh, this sucks. No, I hate fishing. We're wasting all our energy uh, fucking fishing up sticks. What am I, a stick fisher? I'm gonna sit back in our spooky house and stare at the spooky wall. Ha. <sighs> Quigna's angry. I hate this town. Grandpa selling us with a hundred thousand golds worth of debt. Robin knocking at the door with a baseball bat. Demetrius behind her with a Hessian sack. They're going to send Grigna to meet Grandpa. And not in the nice way. Oh, well, we're full of energy. Alright, let's watch the TV. People are saying, please watch the TV. Well, we don't need to... We don't need to know the fortune. Very displeased today. Weather report. Is it raining? It's going to be clear and sunny all day. No, alright, that's, that's a good point. They probably... Je I don't watch TV, look. I'm a millennial. They probably don't give a weather report for the for the day that the weather is happening on. That would be very that would be very foolish. I mean I mean I almost feel like Grigna should just go to bed at this point. If the, if we're really, really unlucky. What the fuck was that noise? Grigna's stomach, he's a very hungry boy. Just eat a seaweed, moron. He's got everything a growing boy needs. Seaweed. As in I seaweed. <laughs> I smoke it. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Here, take it. Go on, take my coral. There you go. Keep an eye on the shipping bin next time Grigna sells something. It's so very subtle. Ah, oh, there we are. Let's go to sleep for the night. I hate today. I feel like there's no point fishing on a day that's so incredibly cursed. Wow, 280 closer to getting our magic sack. Didn't speak to a damn person. <laughs> That's not true. We saw Mayor Lewis. Okay, how are we looking? The day is in your hands. What the hell does that mean? Does Is that neutral luck? The day is in your hands. Oh, the music's here. Oh, there we are. Fantastic. Past it. One days. We're all one days, really. No, fucking open the, open the chest, Grigna. Sorry, blow, 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 bl
I, it's nothing. I, I genuinely thought I saw a person out the corner of my eye. Nothing, Eldritch. Everything is very normal. Don't panic. Right, let's put all this stuff away. Maybe we'll try fishing again today and it'll probably go a little better. Lovely jaunty tune keep. Oh, take your hoe. Take your hoe. Give me that. Okay, let's get out there. Got a backpack with Grigna's name on it. Oh, what a bus. I still hate the fucking creepy eyes in the darkness. My god. It's like Raffalesia, but for Grigna. The big, stinky, alluring smell. Trying to get Grigna to go in there. And then when he the heads in the big dark hole, he gets devoured. And then after that, he gets on the bus. <laughs> Where are we going? Clint's pissed. Do not fear, Clint. Grigna will help you. Will help you with your ore problem. Oh, Woolly wants me to catch three sardines. We get to keep the fish. I always knew I liked Willy. And the fisherman's not bad either. All right, that's enough. Oh, Penny. Sorry, I forgot we should speak. This is a game about speaking to people, isn't it? Hello. You're very lucky. We're very lucky to have a library in such a spot. Grigna can't read. He just eats the books. Hello. Yes, yeah, starting to feel... Wow. Grigna can't read. Jesus, I wasn't wrong. The air's starting to warm up. I'm feeling pumped. Thanks, Alex. Oh, beautiful lady. Mm. Speaking of holes you shouldn't get into. Right, let's head, let's head out. Let's head out of town. Let's see if we can see that prick Elliot over at the beach. Goddamn big-headed philosophy spouting. Andrew Tate subscribing prick Elliot. What's over here? Actually, nothing of value has been found. Well, let's go to Grigna's special beach. Is the man that sells the mermaid amulet always over there, even if you haven't repaired the bridge? Really makes you think. Oh, is the implication he's a mermaid? Oh, maybe. You've done it again, Watson. God, I wish we could walk, like, 15% faster. It's just like, it's, 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 they really nailed getting it at that perfect level where it is just monumentally frustrating. Willie. Hello. I don't know why I'm here. I was just going to say hello. Right, let's catch him a sardine. The man loves sardines. The day is in Grigna's hands. Fish away, Grigna. You moron. Fish away, Grigna. Nice. Oh, it's a good day to be Grigna. Come on. Come on, show us that sardine. Don't give me any of that flounder shit. We don't want any anchovies, halibuts, herrings. Nor treasure. Nor trash. Just sardines. Can we sit on the bench? That would be a good way to get energy back. Yes! Sardine time. Right, remember. Don't move the bar. Yes? No! How is anybody supposed to do that? And that's a sardine right there. Shit. Hang on. ka -chow. Look at that. He's beginning to believe. Come on. This one's for old Willy. Old fishy Willy. Come on. Yes. Give me that sardine. Right. Don't move it until you are absolutely certain. Oh, nailed it. I'm so good at fishing. No, I don't want the fucking flounder. How much is it worth? Oh, I want the flounder. 150. My God. Robin's never going to know what hits her. Oh, shit. Oh, no. I'm I'm botching it. Oh, Christ. Oh, whatever. Commit. Commit to it, Grigna. The music's gone again. It's putting me on edge. Come on. This one's for old Willy. Please. <laughs> oh, come on. Can you even craft a better fishing rod? Am I going mad? There he is. The creepy guy. Probably lo lo looking at us more than I think. What a what a boneheaded fool! Well, he was working out his muscles. I was working out the true muscle, the brain. If you'll excuse me, I'm far too busy reading Nietzsche than to be out there fishing like a barbarian. God, stop catching the flounders, you weird man! But Elliot could catch a. Sardine. 
I love that the fish are animated. That's a great mod. Now we can see their suffering in real time. Now you can see as they gasp for air on your hot bar. Thank God. Come on, Grigler. Just, just go and drown him, for God's sake. Please go and drown Elliot. Oh, I hate him. I don't think I've ever... Oh! I don't think I've ever hated a man more. Oh, they're fishing the ocean out there. Oh, there are actually fish out there. Oh. Oh, but no. no. I'm too busy moderating r slash atheism. What do I do with the fishes when I've got them? Return to Willy. As the fellow, have I got to walk around? You piece of shit, Willy. Oh, hey, you should see the Grigner. I don't know what voice I gave him. Oh, he's by Pirate Man. A sardine is an exciting catch, don't you think? Oh, yeah, absolutely. They're always hiding in the most peculiar places. Is that the excuse you give to the town doctor? Here's your reward. Congratulations. Thank you. No, Willie, keep your reward. The reward was fishing itself. No, I'm just kidding. Hand it over. Give me your wallet while I'm here. Just drown him. You could, you could, you could take him out. That's you versus the guy she tells you not to worry about. Ooh, hello, Grigner. <laughs> oh, thank you for gracing me with your, your mighty knowledge. You won't waste any more words on us. We wouldn't understand. He has quite the immense vocabulary. Uh. Oh, Rusty Spoon. I like Rusty Spoons. Thank you. You found an artifact. I was supposed to be Salad Fingers, but I got a sore throat. I like Rusty... Oh, does he sound again? Hilbert Cumberdale, you smell of soot and poo. Something like that. What? You know what it is. You know what it is. We all know Salad Fingers. If you don't... Show it to your children. Sit down for a nice family viewing. Man, the soundtrack I, 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 like sent a shiver down my spine. Oh, can we get away with this? Oh, it's okay. We've already done it. Speaking of bin chases, Lewis. The saloon can get pretty lively at night. Sometimes we even put a coin in the jukebox. Saloon can get pretty lively at night. Sometimes you put a coin in the jukebox. Are you saying that there are orgies in there? Silent orgies. That's very weird. Just the slapping can be heard. Echoing through the valley. Caroline. I wonder if I can get Pierre to cook dinner tonight. Hello. You're a farmer, huh? Interesting. Jesus Christ. You're as talkative as Elliot. I'm hungry. Where's mum? Uh, you're a bit old to be... <laughs> you know what? Uh, how you people live your life here is on you. I'll be baking cookies today. I like to make flower shapes. <laughs> <laughs> She's, she can't see a damn thing. Oh, your flower cookies are lovely, Evelyn. They're really just delicious. They're burnt to a fucking crisp. No one's got the heart to tell her otherwise. Right, what are we doing, Greg? Now, let's come up with a game plan here. I don't know when the mine opens. Um, have we got enough money to buy a backpack yet? Let's do a bit more fishing. Honestly, that's doing well for us. I presume these are needed for community bundles, though, too, aren't they? Oh, maybe not. Spring foraging, definitely. Should we go to the community center? That's probably not a terrible idea. All right, let's do it. Kachinga, look at that. What a cast. Emily. Shit. Emily. Zygrigna. I hope you're farming in a sustainable way. The valley's ecosystem is fragile. Fracking. There's one thing I'm farming, Emily, and it's the smell of sweet, sweet oil. <laughs> Grigna the Texas Oil Baron. Right, let's fish from here. Maybe this is better. Oh, come on. You can do better than that. Oh, shit. Well, I'll do whatever. That's like right next to land, you moron. Grigna, open your damn eyes. There's that guy. Sam, I think. <laughs> shit name. What a loser. Ah, it's a peaceful town. What a peaceful town. Valley system <laughs> ecosystem is fragile. We're fishing up actual full-on fecal matter out of the lake. Oh! Townspeople have to swim in this river. There's no wonder they're all a bit weird. 
Hello. How you doing? Cards look great this time of year, don't they? Nope. I can't see them. Grigan has got that, uh, got that grind set, you see. While you're staring up at the clouds, Griganer is doing investment banking. He's got that crypto grind. Web 3.0. It's the future, bro. You've got to think about big data. Synergistic applications with NFT metaverse. Something. <clears throat> it's not the most action-packed experience. <laughs> Hello. Thank you. Give me my money. Oh, well, well we're going to get this backpack in no time. We get this backpack in no time. Honestly, I was kind of hoping that I could spend these couple of days just going around speaking to the speaking to the people. You know, get them to like Gregna. Hello. It's Morris, everybody. Hello, Morris. How are you doing? We're currently in the process of setting up a brand new membership system. We can't join Joe Jamart yet. Are we going to do that? Are we going to be evil Texas oil baron Gregna? I don't know if I could... I don't know if I could do it. I feel bad for the guy. Emily would never forgive me. Right. Okay. Remember. Don't move it until the fish is basically at the top. Boom. I'm a goddamn expert. A golden bream. Actually, there's no point doing any more fishing because our backpack's full. I'd have to throw away my rusty spoon and my broken TV. Wait, the rusty spoon's an artifact. Oh, shit. Oh. Come on. <gasps> Treasure! Nice. I think that was worth it. Oh, a streak of one. There you go. Oh, is that how it works? You have to catch treasure to... Oh, so it is working. Ah, oh, big if true. Frozen tear. Oh, my God. Well, I'm going to have to throw away my fecal matter that I keep in my backpack. Mixed seeds. I don't even know what those do. Well, I mean, I, I uh, take it from the impl implication. Plant them and see what grows. Sure. Grigna starts a drugs farm. Clint, you weird man. He's actually weird. British has been slow lately. Thank you, Clint. Everybody has that voice in this town. Have you noticed? Well, I mean, they are from the same town. Oh, with the museum shuts it. Oh, it is 7.20. Okay, far enough. We should go to the saloon. Everybody's at the saloon. I mean, there's nothing else to do in this town. Let's go see one of their mighty silent flash orgies. My God, I hope George is there. Hello. Oh, forget about George. Holy shit. I've been looking forward to this beverage. <laughs> Let's give it the breath. I've been looking forward to this beverage all afternoon. <laughs> wow. You look like quite the drink yourself, madam. How do I know? I have a strong gut feeling. How do you know what? The fuck? Hello. Hey, you look like you could use a beverage. How dare you? Hey, you could. Is that all he says? Okay, fair enough. <coughs> there it is. The mighty beast that Grigna had to slay. Bear hat not to scale. Or maybe bear to scale. Jesus Christ. That's a big old bear. Hello. You should upgrade your tools. I could use the cash. No, Clinton. I'm not joining your fucking Patreon. Good God. Get a real job. The arts are pointless. You know that. Trying to ply your trade with me. Don't even think about it. What pathetic man you are. we get a real job, a 9 till 5, with no creative freedom, where you can burn out. You don't even burn out in a 9 till 5, you just lose your very heart and spirit. Take this, take this bream, take this b bass, take this flounder, take these sardines. Frozen tear, I guess we'll keep. I don't know what they do, though. Actually, I don't know what they do. Flounder, that's gone. Would I, would I rather, hear me out here, would I rather have a backpack or some frozen tears that I could always get more of? Well... When you phrase it like that, kapow. Well done. Good work. Good work, Gregna. I was using the last of this evening to, um... I did war to the parsnips, didn't I? I was using the last of this evening to, uh... Drop our stuff off. Here you go. Let's plant these. Fuck it, why not? Let's do one of those. Oh, sorry. One of those. One of those. And there's something on it. <gasps> oh! Gregna's had one too many. 
Right. Let's try it now. Is that genuinely the problem? You shit. There you go. We got parsnip, a parsnip, and a cauliflower. That's probably going to die. No, you can grow spring crops into summer, can't you? I, th I think that's how it works. I don't remember. The, the parts I remember of Stardew Valley is 0% uh, of the farming. Ironically, it's the least interesting part of the entire game. Yeah, take that. Uh, and take all these. Grigna will keep his rusty spoon. He will caress it. Deeply. Hello! Time to go to- Oh, that's so weird. <laughs> the little bear head poking up over the- <laughs> Oh, shit. <gasps> Fishing proficiency, thank you. Day four of spring, year one. Did we get enough dollar to finally buy the backpack? I think we've done it. Pierre, hand it over. What's that? Traveling merchant in this town. The day is in my hands. Archaeology. You found an ancient looking object. Could it be some kind of artifact from long ago? Perhaps Gunther, curator of the local museum, has the answer. I'm, I, if anybody's got the answer, it's probably fucking Elliot. He's got an answer to everything. G look! Lasagna! Hello, Gregner. You see this cat here? How could I miss it? God, I hate Mondays. I found it sitting outside the entrance to your farm. I think it's a stray, poor little thing. Little? Money is bigger than you. I think it likes this place. Do you know, I think your farm could use... Sorry, did you not see the fucking sign, Marnie? How do you spell cat? Oh, yeah, D-O-G, you moron. Will you adopt... Fucking no. No, 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 no. No! I, 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 I meant that as a joke. No. Shit. Shit. To our value, Georgia Mark customers. Our team members have removed the landslide caused by a drilling operation in the mountain lake. Let's remind you that drilling operation is entirely legal pursuant to uh, in it. I don't know. In, in, initial, initial something. Uh, L61091, Georgia Co. Amendment, responsible for the stewardship of the local environment, is our top priority. We apologize for any inconvenience. This accident may have caused. As always, we value our continued support and patronage. Morris. What is that? In it. I N I T dot. Initial. Initialize. I have no idea. English is my first language. Give me a break. Right, where are we going? Well, my first language is the truth, because that's all I speak. Uh, give me my watering can. Trusty, precious watering can. Oh! Yeah, how about water these nuts? I'm about to make fat stacks. Boom. Your guy has done it. Right, let's uh, let's pop one of those in there because we need that for a bundle. Oh, no, maybe we don't. Hang on. Do we not need it for a bundle? Oh. Oh, wow. Well, I'm just going to sell all of those and then they can piss off. Excellent. Well, let's dump those. Big money coming to Grigna. Now, we could be sensible about this whole situation, right? How long till, su how long till summer? Uh, M for calendar. No. Esk for calendar. Ah, uh, fuck. <laughs> uh, how do I find the calendar? C. That's just water. P. O. L. To do list. Uh, M. N. N is for heart event. B. B for calendar. Balander. Um. Oh, so it is twenty-eight days per season. Oh shit. Okay. Wow, it's like real life. That's crazy. Yeah, you can have this. Uh, 20, no, no, no. When I said 28 days per season, it's like, no, that's not what I meant. That's not what I meant. You know that's not what I meant as well. Don't get, don't take that tone with me. Right, so let's go and see the traveling merchant. Uh, we'll probably need to take the sickle, the hoe, the scythe, whatever you want to call it. And let's cut ourselves a swath through this overgrown wilderness to battle. Oh, I miss Garfield. I thought, I, I don't know why, I had it in my mind that you say no and then she's like, you know, oh, don't be like that, please take it as a pet. And then if you say no, she's like, oh, don't be like that, please take it as a pet. Is that a different game? What game am I thinking of? Where they force you to take the pet? In Pokemon? 
I want a Pokemon Garfield ROM hack. Get on that. Modern community? Don't let me down again. Uh, it, it, do we go down here? Normally, you just go to Marnie's by going south. Shit. <laughs> you can see the problem. <laughs> Fuck. That was optimistic, I'll admit. Get out of my way. There's Greg in this farm now. God damn, Robin. She didn't do anything. What's 100,000 for? Or repoint the stonework sticker front door on the damn thing. You want 100,000 for that. Meanwhile, the garden's like the fucking Amazon out here. We're going to find uncontacted tribes if we keep going at this rate. That's very, that's very pleasant. That's good audio design. I like that a lot. Well done. Well done. Great work. You know what? I've decided. We're going to put this game on the map. I'm going to give it a Mr. Samuel Streamer seal of approval. Maybe they'll actually get some sales on this damn thing. On this little unknown indie gem. The next one's coming out soon. Chocolatier. Actually, I think that's just all it's called. Chocolatier. Haunted, haunted Chocolatier, right? Either way, it seems like it's got a little more... Perhaps a little more of a Terraria influence to it. By which I mean there's a Queen Bee boss fight. That's good. Sorry. That was probably unsensitive. Insensitive. Rest in peace, Big Liz. Sorry. You don't kill the Queen Bee. She just falls into slumber. Howdy. Hello, Marnie. Why, why am I here again? Oh, I'm not here to see you. You can fuck off. <laughs> Sorry, I'm here to see the far more important merchant. Ah, oh, this is nice. I hate that no music plays on Greg and the That's very troubling. It's a joyless place. Oh my god, look over there. <laughs> it's your mum. Hello. Uh, cave carrot. Oh, madam. Kale. Summer spangle. Or a puffer fish. Or a stone. Or a spicy berry. Tomato seeds. One of them. Egg. Salmon dinner. Kite Master 95. I, I like that. That's a good aesthetic. Rare seed. Spend a thousand to make three thousand. So in the fall, but it takes all season to grow. You gotta break it. What's the American expression? You gotta break a few eggs to make a. <sighs> Shit. You gotta break. What would they say? You gotta, you gotta break a few eggs to make yourself an eggnog or something like that. I don't know. I don't know what you do over there. Weird people. Uh, <laughs> do we need any of these for any, any packs? Probably not. Ooh, but Grigna can make a delicious spice berry alcohol. Is it worth planting any of these? I think that'll do. I think we'll take the rare seed, because eventually we could turn the rare seed into wine. We could sell it for 3,000, or Grigna follows his dream of being a master brewer and takes it even further beyond. Ah. Is that not a good metaphor for life? That if you stay too contained in your own territory, in the safety of your own your own part of the world, your own your whether that is your homestead, your living area, or your job, the music from life can go. But when you step outside and you sm smell the flowers and you see the greater world, maybe that's when the music returns. Or maybe this is a modded farm and uh, they forgot to put any music in it. That's probably it. That's probably it. It's a joyless world. It's a thoroughly joyless world. Yeah, take my seed. I think that's the point of this game, right? And then, uh... <laughs> just a bit, of a bit of a water. Well, this has been a pleasant experience. You know what? I said today we're going to get that frigging backpack and I'm sticking with it. We're going to go get that frigging backpack. Now, uh, get me my hoe. Just in case we see any worms. I, I think we'll, we'll try and fill up all the community bundles. That's the goal for the game, obviously. Uh, maybe the museum. I know there's also the collection log you can do as well, where you pick up, like, every item in the game. Uh, counterpoint, that sucks. That's, like, really shit. If you aim to do that, it becomes a chore. But if that... Oh! Old man, I got your request. It's time for a showdown. Pistols at dawn. Sorry, pistols at 20 past 12. Doesn't really have the same ring to it. Oh, hi there. 
Well, there it is. What an eyesore! How day? That's premium bear leather. This is the Pelican Town Community Center. Or what's left of it anyway? Old and decrepit, much like you, as I looking in a mirror, Lewis. It used to be the pride and joy of town, always bustling with activity. Now we have to have the orgies in the saloon. It's so sticky. Now, now just look at it. <laughs> it's shameful. These days, the young folks would rather sit in front of the TV than engage with the community. Well, listen to me, I sound like an old fool. You look like one too. Georgia Corporation have been helping me to sell them land so they can turn it into a warehouse. Pelican Town could use the money, but they're certainly stopping me from selling it. I guess old timers like me get attached to the relics of the past. If anyone buys a Georgia Co. Oh, if anyone buys a Georgia Co. membership, I'm going to go ahead and sell it. You've put too much power in my hands. <sighs> Let's go inside. What? No, if Morris was a smart businessman, which he's not. He would say, oh, Grigner, look, big man, we need the land. You need money to pay off your debt to the Robin Mafia. We're going to give you 50 big ones, big man. Big ones for a big man, 50 of them. And you're going to buy a membership for obviously at a heavy discount using the money we've given you. And if there's any change left over, you, well, you can put that in your pocket and forget about it. And then they could come in and take what is clearly a haunted house. And turn it into a warehouse that will benefit the community. Cheap goods imported from overseas, destroying the environment and local business. Well, I guess Vincent and Jazz have been playing in here. This place is even more dilapidated than I remember. Vincent died of asbestos. Jesus Christ, there's an apple waving at me. Green has had one too many of those, uh... Too, mu one too much of his grandpa's stash. What's the matter, you will? Dysentery. From where he's been eating the fish out of the toxic water. You saw something. I wouldn't be surprised this place was full of rats. There's only one rat in here, Lewis. It's like a pantomime. It's behind you. You're worrying me, Grigner. You've been doing that crack again. <laughs> I think I'm going to head home. I need some lunch. Uh, by which he means money. Hey, I'll keep this place in luck from now on. Maybe we can catch that rat if you have some extra time. What the fuck do you think Grigner's doing? The man's a farmer, one of the hardest working professions. Going one of the oldest and grandest and noblest professions that has kept humanity on the face of this planet. You think he's got time to piss around chasing rats, old man? Unbelievable. Let's go to the water. Hello, old lady Evelyn. How are you doing? George spends the whole day in front of that darn television set. I get it. You see, it's a very ironic commentary on people enjoying what they want to enjoy, regardless of their age or their very nature. It's about what's in their soul. Not what's on the outside. And not what time has dictated. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Push him in. Push him in. No, oh, the fresh air of this valley is good for body and mind. <laughs> God, I, I just... I, I've never hated a human being more. I could not name a single more hated human than Elliot from Stardew Valley. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> We need to do a tier list of this game, don't we? When it's all said and done. So far, I don't think there's a single person that Grigna likes. He respects Robin because she, you know, she's a fearsome warrior. She gets what she's owed. Well, she gets what she owed. It isn't fucking owed as well. Grigan is out here fishing up sticks from the ocean, desperately trying to feed himself and his family. Meanwhile, she's living in a four-story mansion with its observatory. Oh, shite. Fucking fish. Hey! That's a big one. 
Wowee. 45. 60. How is a sardine worth more than a herring? What? They're both the same quality, too. In what world? Sardines are tiny little guys. Not big and strong like Grigna. Right, hand over your fill. Oh my god. It's a wily one. Arr! With my last breath, I. Oh, well, there we go. Flounder, thank you. Oh, Jesus. Oh, it was a misfire. It was a miss input. It's a good reference. It's a good reference. It's an old classic. I just want to check the journal while I'm fishing. Jesus Christ, am I. Is it so difficult to multitask in this land? Everybody's capable of doing one thing at once. No more, no less. You can farm, then you can catch rat. Then you can stand on the beach and look longingly into the sunset. Why am I so lonely? Proclaims man who hangs around exclusively on a beach. Hand it over. Give me that, give me that fish. That's for Grigna now. Please hand over the fish. Boom. Look at that. Oh my god, Piers is gonna shut. No, no, no. It's Wednesday, my dudes. It's Friday. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Willy, 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 willy. Willy. Take it, take it, take it, take it. Have we got enough? Shit! Was that R2-D2? Are you a fucking robot? Push him in. Short circuit him. New Greek straw outdoors always invigorates me. Uh. 28 points in Scrabble. Well done. <laughs> oh, there's fish bubbles over there. So is it worth it to go for fish bubbles that are by the shore? Than it is to cast out horizontally into deep ocean. Maybe. Maybe. It's old man Willy. Push him in, Willy. You're a real one. Oh my god, what's he doing? Holy shit. I think he's Jesus. I think he's Jesus. Just to clarify, this is a new save with all of the other stuff removed. That there, there, there has never been any extra maps in this save. This was a whole new character, remember? Uh, Elliot is just Jesus. I need you to understand that. He's focusing his chakra to the soles of his feet. Thank you. Bye, Willy. Enjoy your cider. Oh, we gotta go to the beach. I tell over there. Let's see what we can find. I don't think this, this investment has quite paid itself off yet, nor do I think it ever will. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah, no, this is great. That was good. Really glad I chopped down all those trees to get one seaweed. That was definitely worth it. I mean, where else would you find seaweed at the ocean? Oh, burn it down. Just burn the fucking thing down. I, I, you know, I'm always suspicious of a man that has a rowboat when he can walk on water. If you dig in the dirt... You can find interesting things. Now, what you'll think is that's a very banal, boring, wallflower thing to say. Representative of Penny herself. But when you think about it, she's trying to get you to dig deeper. Oh, Clint wants some ore. Clint needs everything else but ore. She's, in, she's trying to encourage us to dig deeper into the, into the eldritch secrets. If you, di if you dig in the dirt in town, there's only one thing you'll find, and it's bodies. It's full on human remains. I hate this town and everyone in it. The Grigna story, right? Let's sell this crap. I hope Garfield comes back. <laughs> it's on me. Tomorrow we'll buy the bag from Pierre. We've done it. We can go to the mines. We'll go to the mines tomorrow. And then we'll buy the bag from Pierre. Good night, Grigna. Good night, Garfield. Mar Marnie took Garfield out the back and rang his neck. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.